It is a featherweight matchup between Max Holloway and Arnold Allen. So here we go with round one, classic matchup of striker versus striker. These guys have both faced a lot of grapplers in the past. They like the draw tonight. Oh yeah, they love seeing an opponent that will not be trying to dive at their legs. They know when they get to the center of the octagon, the only steps back they will take is if they choose to move out of range to re-enter back into the striking realm. It's a very comforting thought for both these veterans. Well, he has certainly found the range and staying pretty busy here on the field. He's being busy, but it's also the timing and the accuracy that's allowing him to land so many attacks. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the center. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. This big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Big kick lands. Just over three minutes to go round one. All right, so a nice shot there defensively. To oh, well, if you like Muay Thai striking, this might be your moment in this fight as he gets the tie clutch. This is a massive moment for this fighter. He is a great Muay Thai fighter. Look for him to go knee-knee and then try to land a big one to the head. Trying to establish that jab once again. Oh, good job defensively there to block the strike. Certain the finish could come at any time. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. He's got to be careful to dip his head when he's throwing that jab. You don't really understand. After you take a head kick like this, that is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that one. And landing some nasty strikes. And a nice jab there, champ. The jab was a lost art in mixed martial arts. Guys have found it, and they are fighting behind it real well. So there's the horn. He got knocked down by a punch in that round, but he is able to survive. We'll see if they can make some adjustments. He's as tough as they come. He took that shot and he kept plodding forward. He got off of his butt. He got himself off of the canvas and tried to get right back to work. But he cannot take many more of these. You don't want to be the guy that's testing how tough that your chin is. Round two is underway. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. This might be the biggest shot of this entire fight. He lands a massive hook to put his opponent on wobbly legs. Again, the winner here was so aggressive.
Joseph with his onslaught that ultimately appeared as though the outcome was an eventuality. So if you're the referee, you got to protect the fighter. And I thought he did a good job of doing just that. The official decision is in. That's where we find Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at one minute, five seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by TKO, Arnold Almighty Allen. Well, there he is, the man of the hour.